Hello friends, can I ask you something personal today? Are you perfect? When you were in school, did you always get perfect tests, grades, never make a mistake? You ever sass back to your parents? You ever forget an appointment? Are you a perfect parent, always did the right thing with your kids? You know, we make a lot of mistakes in our lives. And it's one thing if we make a mistake that hurts somebody around us, but it's another thing when those mistakes are things that offend our holy God. When that happens, we fall under a curse. As the Apostle Paul tells us in Galatians chapter 3, all who rely on observing the law are under a curse. For it is written, cursed is everyone who does not continue to do everything written in the book of the law. The book of the law are the things God wants us to do. And when we don't do them perfectly, do everything exactly as God wants it to, then we fall under his anger, under his curse. Oftentimes we go along in life and we don't even realize what is making us troubled, what is burdening our conscience. And sometimes it's just this very fact that we are under a curse and we know we make mistakes, but we don't know what to do about them. A couple of verses later, Paul tells us how we can regain peace. He says, Christ redeemed us from the curse of the law by becoming a curse for us. For it is written, cursed is everyone who is hung on a tree. You know what that tree is. It's the cross that Jesus was killed on. But he was killed on that cross. He died on that cross because God's curse was upon him. Not a curse that he deserved, but a curse that we deserved. He took our curse upon him. And when he did that, he took away God's anger from us. He freed us from being afraid of God. So we don't have to live afraid if we make mistakes because Jesus has taken away the curse. Through faith in Jesus, we can have perfect peace with God and live in that peace each day. Let's pray. Lord Jesus, thank you for taking the curse away from us. Give our hearts peace today.